I'm Dan Galpin. Welcome back to The Game Show. Today we're going to talk about the new Android Performance Tuner, a library within the Android Game SDK that unlocks game performance insights within Android Vitals, giving you a way to both measure and optimize the graphical fidelity and frame rate of your game across the Android device ecosystem, all on real devices with real users. Let's break down exactly what that means. Unlocking Performance Insights requires integrating the Android Performance Tuner library, which relies on tick functions being called each frame. If you've already integrated the Android Frame Pacing API to help you get smoother frame rates and improved support for high refresh rate displays, or are using Unreal 4.25 Plus, you pass in the Swappy Inject Tracer function from the Frame Pacing API at initialization to enable automatic frame time recording. In Unreal 4.25 Plus, you also need to enable the Frame Pacing API, which you can do for all Android devices by adding a.uswappy for frame pacing equals 1 to the Android underscore default profile. And if you're using Unity, we've built a plugin that makes it easy to integrate the Android Performance Tuner. Once you've done the basic integration with or without the Frame Pacing API, the next step is to define annotation parameters and tie them to quality levels, scenes, or other areas of interest in your game, and make calls in the appropriate places to inform the Android Performance Tuner API. If you're using Unity with the Android Performance Tuner plugin, you'll automatically get a scene annotation that maps to the current scene being played, as well as a UI to define additional annotations. In a C++ native engine integration, you define these annotations using a protocol buffer. Then you need to make calls to the Android Performance Tuner API to inform it of contextual changes. Once you have the integration and annotations in place, you enable the Android Performance Parameters API in the Google Cloud Console to start collecting data. The data will be used to produce a chart of frame rate performance broken down by the quality levels you've built into your game, so you can see how specific device models or hardware specifications are performing on each quality level. We also analyze your performance data to help determine the likely cause of issues, so you can differentiate between problems associated with specific hardware and problems with specific screens or levels in your game. The annotations provide contextual information about what your game is doing at that point, giving you full control over the granularity of the insights. We call out the top device model issue as well as the top game specific issue to give you clear guidance on what's most important. You can drill down to see a breakdown of underperforming device models by different specs, such as GPU and SoC. This allows you to decide whether you can work at the GPU or SoC level to optimize performance, or detect these cases and change the quality level. You can also see the full list of device models along with the number of affected user sessions and frame time, to help you prioritize device-specific changes. As well as total frame time, we also show you GPU time to help determine whether the device is GPU bound or has another performance problem, such as being CPU or I.O. bound. All data in the device model table can be exported for further analysis and action planning. We can also help identify opportunities, places where you could potentially provide users with a better experience by giving them a higher quality level, enabling more advanced graphical features. The devices on the far left are more than meeting the frame times for smooth performance. You can drill down to see stats by device model and specification to see if there is an opportunity to improve the graphical fidelity across a wide range of devices. The Android Performance Tuner is intended to work across 99% of the Android device ecosystem. You can get these insights on any Android devices around the world from Android 4.1 onwards. It's part of our commitment to helping you bring the best version of your game to the widest number of users and devices in the Android ecosystem. Android Performance Tuner within the Android Game SDK, the plugin for Unity, and Performance Insights within Android Vitals are all available now. As always, thanks for your support in continuing to build incredible games. We've provided links in the description to our documentation that includes a walkthrough of the integration process as well as a step-by-step -step code lab. I'm Dan Galpin for The Game Show. Please remember to like, subscribe, share, and stay safe.